Welcome to my place and sushi gifting office. I'm Nelan, the chief empowerer and the founder of Sushi Gifting. Sushi Gifting is a social enterprise and we aim to help people, uh, to empower people who are trapped behind closed doors. These are my kids, my family members, and they are the inspiration behind this business. Together with SPS students, we are here to turn all this uh, planking, um, this audience of average trade and upcycle them in useful handicraft that is made by people who wish to be empowered or to find employment. So we started this as a one-man show and today we grew into a team of worker with um, 20 over students. So we work with partners like Lions Defenders, uh, with Bishan Home, with Mind, with Whistling and we help people who are um, uh, who have mental disability, who are people who are trapped behind a door because of social isolation. We help people with autism. We help people from all walks of life. We help them find strength in what they do. And all this miracle that I just mentioned started from this basement office. And what we do here is, this is the central office and we have a very good staff that I want to introduce to you and she's pink. She's our craft curator and our social media curator. So right now I'm preparing the craft for our stay at home mom. Or she bring it down to her place and also catch up with her sometimes. So here are our drawings by our elderly and these are the tools that we use for crafting. So here are our, some of our favorites and possibly some of our favorites. This is a bag done by Madam Alima, made from scrap materials like what Bella mentioned we support us. So this is one of our best seller. They are soy wax sachets and people usually buy from the sheets and things like that. So after I curate all these products, I'll actually send it to Lily who will do our order fulfillment. I think I'm done with our office tour and I'll get back to work. Brandon most likely is waiting for you upstairs. So I'll see you again. Bye! I just wanted to share with you another story. You know, there's so many times I feel like giving up. But it's the seniors, the crafters, and the volunteers like you that gave me the strength to tell me to carry on. And I just want to say a shout a big thank you to you guys. We really need people like you to care for society, especially people who are trapped in my clothes box. And what you can do to help is to simply buy a gift, volunteer with us, or to have us spread the word. Thank you so much for being with us today. I hope to see you soon again. This way. Thank you.